Hi friends, it's Miss Becky. I'm excited to bring you a special baby time at home today. My stories and activities will mostly be geared towards babies and toddlers, but I hope all ages can enjoy. I definitely miss all of my baby time and all of our story time families. I'm thinking about you and I hope that you're doing well. So we're gonna start with our hello song that we sing every week at baby time. So if you know it, sing it along with me. We're gonna smile and wave. Everybody smile and wave, smile and wave, smile and wave. Everybody smile and wave. I'm so glad you're here. All right, our first rhyme is called Dance Your Fingers. Can you get your hands ready? Here we go. Dance your fingers up, dance your fingers down. Dance your fingers to the side, dance them all around. Dance them on your shoulders. Dance them on your head. Dance them on your tummy. And put them all to bed. Our next one is called Hands Are Clapping. So get your hands ready again. Here we go. Hands are clapping, clap, clap, clap. Hands are clapping, clap, clap, clap. Hands are clapping, clap, clap, clap. Clap your hands, my darling. Ready to wiggle those fingers again? Wiggle your fingers, wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle your fingers, wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle your fingers, wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle your fingers, my darling. Okay, last we're gonna do eyes are hiding. Peekaboo. Eyes are hiding, peekaboo. Eyes are hiding, peekaboo. Eyes are hiding, peekaboo, peekaboo, my darling. All right, my first book today is called Where is Baby's Belly Button? It's by Karen Katz. And my readings today are done with permission from Simon and Schuster. This is a lift the flat book. Those are always fun. Where are baby's eyes? Under her hat. Here they are. Where is baby's mouth? Behind the cup. Where is baby's belly button? Where is your belly button? Can you find it? It's under her shirt. Where are baby's feet? Behind the cat. Where are baby's hands? Under the bubbles. Where is baby? Hmm, should we look under the blanket? There he is. All right, our next song is called This Is The Way, and we can show, show us how some of the things that we do to get ready in the morning with this song. So one important thing to do in the morning and all throughout the day is to wash our hands. Ready? So can you show me how you wash your hands? Here we go. This is the way we wash our hands, wash our hands, wash our hands. This is the way we wash our hands so early in the morning. Next, we're going to brush our teeth. Can you show me how you brush your teeth? This is the way we brush our teeth, brush our teeth, brush our teeth. This is the way we brush our teeth so early in the morning. What about combing your hair? Do you comb your hair in the morning? Let's do that. This is the way we comb our hair, comb our hair, comb our hair. This is the way we comb our hair so early in the morning. Maybe you can think of some other things to add to the song that you do to get ready in the morning. We're gonna move on to our next story, which is called Horns to Toes and In Between by Sandra Boynton. Oh, we've each got these horns on top of our head. And we've each got two ears so we can hear what you said. And we've all got a mouth so we can sing, eat, or talk. And we've all got two feet so we can go for a walk. 
Yes, we've each got 10 toes and we've each got one nose. And we've all got two eyes that can open and close. And we have a fuzzy tummy that we all like to pat and a little belly button in the middle of that. Well, we've each got a back and a tail that is long and two very fine arms and two legs that are strong. We've got two handy hands and our fingers count 10. Can you count them with me? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We can tickle, 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 or just count them again. You see our teeth when we grin. You see our tongues when it's hot. You can watch us shake and shimmy with whatever we got. The end. All right, this next one is great adults if you have um, little ones on your lap. So I have my doll here to show you. It's called crisscross applesauce. And this is always one that they enjoy. So it goes like this. Crisscross applesauce. Fingers tickling your tummy. Cool breeze. Tight squeeze. Now you've got the shiver. Try that one again. Crisscross applesauce. Fingers tickling your tummy. Cool breeze. Tight squeeze. Now you've got the shivers. Our next song is great for getting dressed in the morning and it's called Baby Put Your Pants On. And you can of course use any other clothing item with this song too. So again, I'll show you how you can do it on baby, especially if you have baby up on the changing table while you're getting them dressed. Baby, put your pants on, pants on, pants on. Baby, put your pants on, one, two, three. Baby, put your pants on, pants on, pants on. Baby, put your pants on, one, two, three. Legs to the left, legs to the right. Wiggle and jiggle and pull them on tight. Legs to the left. Legs to the right, wiggle and jiggle and pull them on tight. Baby, put your pants on, pants on, pants on. Baby, put your pants on, one, two, three. You got it. All right, now I have a song that we can do with a scarf. So these are really fun to dance with. We love using these at baby time. And you can use any scarf that you might have at home or a piece of fabric or a ribbon sock, anything that you can just kind of dance around with, throw in the air. And these are great to just put on music and dance around your house with. Um, they're also great for peekaboo. And we're going to do a song called Put Your Scarf in the Air today. So here's how it goes. Put your scarf in the air, in the air. Put your scarf in the air, in the air. Put your scarf in the air. Now set it on your hair. Put your scarf in the air, in the air. Put your scarf on your knees, on your knees. Put your scarf on your knees, on your knees. Put your scarf on your knees. Be sure not to sneeze. <gasps> well, if you do have to sneeze, sneeze into your elbow. Put your scarf on your knees, on your knees. Put your scarf on your tummy, on your tummy. Put your scarf on your tummy, on your tummy. Put your scarf on your tummy. Now rub it nice and yummy. Put your scarf on your tummy, on your tummy. Put your scarf on the floor, on the floor. Put your scarf on the floor, on the floor. Put your scarf on the floor. Now pick it up once more. Put your scarf on the floor, on the floor. There you go. So usually at the end of baby time, we do a fun group activity, and you can definitely do those at home too, um, whether it's rolling balls back and forth or blowing bubbles. And if you don't have bubble solution at home, you can easily make some with dish soap. So you can just search for a recipe online. And also you can do parachute at home too. Just take a light blanket or a sheet and wave it up and down over top of your child or children, and they will have a blast with it. Make sure to also take some one-on-one -on -one time to cuddle up and read a book and um, have playtime as well. Um, I know I'm missing 
baby time play time and I'm sure you and your kids are missing the time with other kids. Uh, so maybe you could try a virtual play date where you video chat with some friends or family while you play. All right, well, we're gonna sing a goodbye song to say goodbye for today. And we're gonna do it to the same tune as our hello song. Everybody wave goodbye, wave goodbye, wave goodbye. Everybody wave goodbye. I hope to see you soon. Thanks for joining me today.